Welcome back to Let's Play Persona 3 FES oh, Blind. Hey, Fuka. What are you doing here? Nothing, really. I come here when I'm feeling down. Is that Chidori's sketchbook? Yeah. This is where I first met her. What are you doing here, Fuka? Oh, I went home for a bit. I've been going back there a lot lately. I see. You know, you've really changed, Fuka. She actually has. You're totally different from when you first came to the dorm. Really? Yeah, you were so timid back then. But now you're so... strong. You've changed too, Junpei-kun. Yukatan said the same thing. But I don't think so. I mean, just the other day I got all freaked out about being scared. I am such a wuss. <laughs> That's not true. But I really was scared. Actually, I'm still scared. But after thinking about it, I realized that I don't want to lose my memory. If I forget everything, that means I'll forget Chidori, too. And I wouldn't even be alive right now if it wasn't for her, you know? So I say F that. You're scared because you're not running away. That's nothing to be ashamed of. Fuka. That's why I want to protect everyone. Think about it. The Dark Hour is really scary too, isn't it? But our persona's awakened, and we're here today. The future hasn't been decided yet. Nothing's been decided. And I want to be true to myself. True to yourself? You're really something, Fuka. We should fight. I agree. Okay, what do they got today? Silver plate. More wine supplements. Ooh, it keeps going up. Yes. Let's go back to the shrine and talk to the dying guy. Because I'm pretty sure I can't do anything with Mitsu except when I'm at school. Nobody treats me like a normal guy, not even my family. I can tell by how they look at me, the pity in their eyes is unmistakable. I don't need their sympathy anymore, and I need their curiosity. I'm sorry, but I don't expect anyone to pity me. Dying isn't so unusual, is it? What is there to gain by staying in this world for a long time anyway? say that necessity is the mother of our industrial society, and yet fire does not realize that it's burning away. Not exactly foolishness, but sad nonetheless. Hey, thanks for coming today. You don't seem like everyone else. I'm not sure how to describe it exactly, but 
You don't look down at me the way everyone else does. Deserve this body. I hope we can meet again. That probably means in some of like the other Hi, accounts I have. How was your day? Good for you. So what do I do on these days? <laughs> Let's start to Mitsuru and see if I can do anything with her. Otherwise, that's just lame. Oh, don't worry about her, she's been treated as we speak. Wait, what? Oh. Now, this is the first part of that. So, I guess it's shrine time! Sadly. I was hoping something would happen during this vacation. But instead, I guess it's just shrine for the next few days and then. Sorry. handle it anymore. Mom and Dad just keep fighting. I yelled them to please stop fighting so much, but they just told me to leave them alone. I made up my mind. I have to run away from home. What? But I thought you were on my side. I'm going to run away. I already made up my mind. I'm going to start packing soon. I stop reading. Either way, I'm going to try. Don't worry, I'll be just fine, okay? I'm going to miss you, though. It won't be easy to be alone. I, why am I doing this? This is a bad and dumb idea. your day yes 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 why do you keep asking me that Ugh. sleep earlier Two more days. Winter vacation continues. There's nothing going on. Ah, boring. I'm sorry. I just I don't really know what they want me to do with this during this time. I 
feel bad going to Shrine Day after day, but there's nothing else I can be doing! I thought I was doing that from the beginning. I didn't have to be all wishy-washy like you guys. You know what? I don't know what's happening soon. Oh yeah, Apocalypse is even worse than the other things I have, so that was a waste of money. No, I was just told Apocalypse, I didn't know what it was. This may mean nothing happened. But that was pretty normal. Yeah. Yep, that's all we have to do. All we have to do, Junpei. Alright, so last day of the shrine, and then we have the 31st. Which may be another day of the shrine. Jeez, oh, how long before I go back to school? Son of a biscuit. Oh, hey, hey cool. it's so me. Can I talk to you? Please, give me something to do. Are you wearing a maid outfit? Nope. Hey, I have good news. I guess is coming back today. Awesome. Mitsuru Senpai said her wounds have finally healed. I don't think she We're heals. We're meeting in the lounge tonight. Don't forget, okay? See ya. Did you close my door? How rude. But gonna let it I guess back. the shrine. To the shrine. It's been one more day at the shrine. And then on to tomorrow. Yep, no, nothing, another nothing day. Hey, let's have this meeting. Hi, I guess. Yay, I guess. I'm back, everyone. Sorry to have worried you all. Man, I'm glad to see you. I was getting nervous. Me too. I was fearing the worst. I'm a machine, so I can always be rebuilt. 
Even if I was completely destroyed, the programming data necessary to recreate me would still exist. But where are your sisters? Hey, don't talk about yourself like that. They said another week would be required for a complete recovery, but I had the process expedited. Tomorrow is New Year's Eve. I'm sorry for all the trouble I've caused. Mitsuru-san visited me at the lab and told me everything. That must have been difficult for you all to hear. You need to hear it, though. Have you been well? I mean, considering the circumstances. I'm sorry. It's because I wasn't strong enough. Ten years ago, I... What I did to you was... <sighs> but... If I hadn't done that to you, you wouldn't be suffering like this. Ryoji has presented you with a difficult choice. Have you made your decision? I have a favor to ask of you. Tomorrow, when Ryoji comes, please, please kill him. I can't bear to see everyone hurting like this. Well, you're going to have to. Please choose to have your memories erased. Even if... Even if it means forgetting everything and everyone. I guess, what are you talking about? Yeah, this isn't like you. What's wrong, I guess? Why? Why did I come back here? My mission is to protect humanity from shadows. But now I know that I can't defeat them. So then... Why am I here? I'm useless. I cannot even shed a tear for you all. Oh, I guess. Why fight when you know that you can't win? Because you don't know. What is the purpose of that? Why are you wasting your lives? We're not wasting our lives. We're just planning for the future. Right, Ken? Right. I... I don't understand. It must be because I don't possess... a life. <laughs> this has nothing to do with having a life. I'm a machine. A machine that was created to protect humans from shadows. But I can't fulfill that mission with the powers I was given. So then... What is my purpose now? Could someone please tell me? We don't know the answer, I guess. The only one who can tell you what your purpose is, is you. That's why we're having such a hard time making our decision. There's just no easy answer. But as long as we're alive, we have to do something. When we see others hurting, we want to help them. So that's our purpose. Can finding one's purpose really be so simple? When I saw you collapse, I realized something. I want to protect you. I don't want to forget about you. Fuka-san. There are times when you will lose sight of your goal, and you will have to search for it. But if you can't find it again, then you must set your heart on a new goal. To truly live, you will need to make changes sometimes. Do you think I can do that? Do you think I can change? Yes. I mean, you've changed so much already. Haven't you noticed? In fact, you're changing even as we speak. I know what my purpose is. I'm a machine. A machine who is here to live. 
And the one who has given me this new purpose is... me. I guess... This is the promise I've made to myself. I don't know how I'll do it, but I guess that is part of living, too. Will you allow me to join with you all? Of course! You've always been one of us! Thank you. I will be with you all, no matter what happens. Now that one doesn't always make a lot of sense. But, cool. Athena, really? <laughs> Alright, and we'll leave the episode here. Tomorrow, we go to the 31st and we don't kill Ryoji. See you next time, thanks for tuning in.